Some time ago, the wire services and newspapers carried a story out of San Francisco describing the first satanic wedding ceremony ever performed. The pictures showed a nude woman lying on the altar behind the guest, whom you see now, the Reverend Anton Zandor LaVey, who is the founder and high priest of the First Church of Satan. Anton Zandor LaVey uses uh, as somewhat of a credo this timeless quote, Remember, evil backwards spells live. <laughs> Somehow that never occurred to me. It never occurred to me until one of my disciples brought it forth, and I imagine uh, it's uh, quite true with many of us. How often do you have, you have to shave your head to make uh, it shiny like a devil? I, I have to put Vaseline on it as well to keep it shiny. I shave it once a day. Can I give a plug? Is that for the that? odor you're giving off now, Vaseline? No, that's It'll fool me. That's musk. That's, that's musk. That's the goatee scent you smell. For sure, it's not frankincense and myrrh. No. Now, that. <laughs> now, what is this uh, ring you're wearing here? Looks like it's weighing your hand down. Well, no, it's a magical ring. It is. I have little children rub it, make a wish, and it comes true. Little children come near you? Of course. <laughs> little they, children. They, what and kind animals. of a wish did that ring ever make come true? Well. I would say uh, a great many wishes, but we won't go into them. Now, you call yourself a satanic priest. Yes. Is that the opposite of God? No, because Satan is a god, too. Mm -hmm. Well, what are you, then, the, uh, the dirty pope or what? Oh, I guess you could call me that if you want to say the black pope or the dirty pope or the, the uh, advocate of, for example, the kingdom of night or darkness. No one's ever come forth so far and spoken up for the devil. Everybody that's made rules and regulations concerning the devil or the devil's work, the devil's activities, have been people that have been very righteous people, people during crusades, people... Well, I'm that... not too righteous, but on the other hand, I think you're a bit of a ding -a let's face it. Either. Were you ever a religious fellow? I, I would say not particularly. You're a young man. I'm a religious you? fellow now, though. How old are you? I'm 36. 36. Who ordained you a satanic priest? I would say probably I received the call. <laughs> Just as any fundamentalist... Well, most of us do, but we fight it. <laughs> well, I fight it. This is, of course, the whole principle of my religion, is all of the what concepts... you mean you received the call? You mean one day the devil said, go out, Anton Zandor LaVey, and give people hell? <laughs> huh? Is that what happened? That's about it. That's about it. Because people like to have a hell of a time, don't they? <laughs> Well, of course, there are all kinds of definitions of that. Well, now... Now, I don't, you know, I mean, to, to marry two people without a license in front of a naked babe lying up on an altar, I don't know what that is. Well, seriously, there are explanations for these things. And how I started was as a result of uh, various reverse forms of therapy. I haven't been a satanic priest all my life, as you probably gathered. You've probably been an inmate part of your life. Well, uh, an inmate in possibly a pretty big institution. Are you at all afraid that someday after you get through this big put-on, you know, with your little red yo-yo and your big fat ring <laughs> and your shiny bald head, that when they do pack you away... Well, you know, now, if, wait a if, minute. If there's any justice, you know, you've got to really get it. Yes, sir. Are you planning on training a lot of little devils? <laughs> Only those that wish to become little devils. Are you married? Oh, yes. Do you have any little devils? Oh, yes, I have two. Are you going to raise them as satanic kids? Certainly, but not to go around chopping people up or sacrificing human beings, just to... Uh... That would be the greatest reward of all if your kid some night would creep in and set fire to you and your lion. <laughs> well, no, huh? no. And then I... dance around with pitchfork and say, Look at daddy, look at daddy. Huh? <laughs> now, if you sleep with your lion, where does Mrs. Devil sleep? Oh, uh, well, she sleeps with the lion, too, you see. Not between us, though. The lion's on one side. Makes for a nice grouping. I don't like. I don't believe in se separating church and state. There are some people in the dock who would like to speak to you. We'll be going to the dock and the devil after these words. <laughs> Listen, our time's all up. I'd like to tell you where to go, but you'd enjoy it. Oh, that's right. We'll be back with another guest after these words. Stand by. <laughs>